few years back with the first refugee families that were actually placed here. They came to the office and they were actually hungry because they did not know how to use and how to prepare, how to open the cans, what was in the cans, because the products, they were actually not familiar to them. My name is Georgia Sepik and I originally came from former Yugoslavia. Throughout the year we are offering 38 different programs to the refugees. We have um, quite a few different English classes, ESL classes, based on the different levels. We also have um, sewing classes for the women. Um, that's a really great success and the women are learning to be self-empowered. Um, we also have um, the bag making program using the recycled materials through um, Missions Logo Bags. My name is Anna Sapik and I do a lot of work with uh, my mom at Serrano Village Apartments working with refugees. I think the greatest success story is seeing some of the kids who are now, who came here as refugees and didn't speak English and now they're attending college, they're getting their degrees, becoming successful. My name is Bawi Chintia and I am from Chinese State in Burma. I am majoring a uh, physician assistant at Grand Canyon University. I want to become a physician assistant and uh, helping my com um, my community. Most of the refugees, they have tremendous stories to share. And each one of them is different, unique. Each one of them is, I would probably say, very painful for them and for the people that actually would listen to stories, what the families did go through, the struggle, the fear, prosecution, and everything else that it actually, Excuse me. When we can actually help them, I think that's what makes all the difference uh, for the refugees. It makes difference to me. It makes difference to everybody else who is actually involved in the refugees.